my other uh, workhorse uh, 620 that thing pulls chain too don't think it's quite got as much snot as my other one but uh, it's pretty close um, this is the, the one that started it all for me on the 620s this is my very first one I put a steel rubber piece on there to hold the, the scrunch it works good with the with the side cover. Um, it's an 84 driver full comp chain that's been ground. I don't remember <laughs> what the angles are on that one. I'd say the top plate's at least a 30. That's probably a 30 and a 45. Um, and that chain would have been done back when I had the pink wheel. <laughs> But, uh, yeah, that's old gas, too. Uh, I guess it's in there. It's over a year old. I'm going to check the bar oil. But, uh, it's probably pretty low. But, uh, yeah. Uh, nothing wrong with these 620s. They're good work saws. I think this one's got touch more chain speed than my other one. My other one's got more pull. Um. This saw's been, been great. You can see how dirty it is. It just sits under the bench. I don't hardly use it anymore. It's one of the ones I don't want to don't want to let go. Uh, I threw that stock for or 261 on uh, Marketplace. I set it up with a 20 inch bar, skip chain 3 8 because uh, I wasn't letting my other lightweight bar and 325 setup go because um, I sometimes run that on big saws on. 
stuff that I can go on so they don't care what chain you're on. Um, and then I threw that uh, six horse 50cc uh, 346 uh, up on Marketplace. Um, I put that out. Uh, wanted 450 for the 261 at stock and uh, wanted 650 for that uh, six horse 346. Just if you guys see it on Marketplace, that's uh, that's why it's on there. But uh, I just, I don't know, since I was playing with the other 620, I figured it was time to get some fuel circulating through there and get a fresh, fresh dose of fuel in the carburetor. But uh, you guys take it easy and have a good one.